Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Sunken Land on the Radio Man 03, and it's awesome to have you along. I finally got a hold of the packet box. You got to be in the, uh, you know, the experimental test branch to get the box to pick things up and move things around. So I have the box now. I moved our chest from downstairs up here so we can add some stuff. I put one over by the bed for our personal stuff. Uh, what else did I do? I think that's about it so far. I was going to go ahead and move this one too. Does this one, is this one empty? Let's see, make sure it's empty first. It's not, it's got my buckets in it, which I don't need anymore really. But then back to two, right click on it. Okay, you pick up the box and you can take the box upstairs and you can have that box someplace else. Just tab, right click on it and now I can place it someplace else. We'll do a little box right over here by this guy. Um, I think I want to try to get a couple more of the workbenches put together today. Uh, I did do a little upgrading and a little changing. I added our um, loft here again to, uh, you know, shoot these guys when they attack us. So we could do that. And then I've added, I've actually upgraded part of our base down below. What do we have for iron left at the moment? Uh, I should be cooking this stuff. Let's go ahead and get that going. I'm going to keep cooking that. Um, what I did was, <clears throat> these take just iron. A single piece of iron all the upgraded um, reinforced stuff takes one piece of iron so I'm thinking about swapping this stuff out and that takes care of my big issue with the scrap metal I'm always wondering where am I gonna get all this scrap metal from but you know if you upgrade to this I think it's better what is it 4,000 hit points I believe and it's a little bit stronger so I put these here and then I put this over here so we can come down here and kind of focus their attention down here I don't want them shooting that stuff up there where I'm gonna try to upgrade this to uh, the heavier metal uh, as soon as possible there too so that we can because uh, they seem to attack from this side I'm imagining they're probably either coming from the raft or from the islands but nevertheless we've got people coming out here and attacking us I don't know what that is right there I don't know what that is uh, there's like trees in the water over here too it looks like I think there's a small island attached to that anyways we're gonna take the boat out and do a little bit of looting today too uh, but the box is really handy. The packing box is very handy. Uh, it's key that if you're playing on the 0104 option, it says old version 0104, make sure you come in first, take everything out of your inventory and put it in a box, and then switch to the uh, test branch. And then you know, what you do is like I spawned, um, I spawned out there in the air like you do at the very beginning with the axe in your hand. So I've got the second axe, but then, you know, you can come back over here and get your stuff and put it back on and you're, you're good to go. So that's for the packing box. <clears throat> Took me forever to get the packing box in my inventory, but there it is. I'm very happy to say it's there. Uh, I'm going to go in here and we're going to drop off you, 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 and you. It's daytime. I don't know what time of day it is at the moment. Oh, you know what I was, I was curious about? Hold on. Let's go back to two again. Can I move these lanterns? I can. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, I'm really glad I can move these guys because sometimes they're just a little bit in the way and I don't have room for a workbench. So it'd be good to kind of, you know, move it to a different spot. Like there. Now I got room for a workbench. I know there's a door here, but at least I could put a workbench like maybe right here. We'll see. But the point is, is now I can move things around and I've got the box. So that's pretty handy. Can I move walls and doors and stuff? Hmm. No, I can't move the structural pieces. Okay, I can move. I can move the foundation. But I can't move walls. Okay. Just the foundations. I guess that's cool. You can move the foundations. If you've got something in here and you go to move it and you've got like I've got wooden here. And if you've got some food, like I've got food here, if you go to move it, it will delete those items. So don't have anything in there when you're um you know moving stuff so it's one ingot each oh I've got I'm out of uh, I'm out of wood it, it's one ingot each for each of the metal reinforced pieces that's not too shabby I think I've got wood over here actually I do there we go perfect oh did I not put more in there we go oh, okay Anyways, um, so that's not that bad. And the iron, I believe, is a renewable resource. I want to run out to that island that we poked our head on and see. I've got an orange flag on it. I want to go over there and see if that iron has respawned. I'm also feeling a little dirty about that island, too, because you guys say that it's because I didn't have 
my thing turned up far enough. Um, not regiment. Garrisons? It wasn't turned up enough, so I feel like I need to take that out. Now, I'm also curious about this. I see these white lines showing up over the top of some of these things, and I'm not quite sure why that does that. <clears throat> you guys got any uh, inside information about this right here? I'm kind of curious about that. See the, the white lines over the top of the fires? It must be something. Um, just a, a thing in the game they've got to work on, I guess. But I noticed that anywhere there's a fire, there's... Um, Definitely some bars going on. Um, I think, since I really don't know what time it is, I'm guessing this it's like midday. I'm going to go ahead and cook up the rest of this iron. I think I've got a little bit of scrap too now, because no, I don't. Uh, Alright, I don't have any scrap metal either. I thought I had some scrap left. Uh, looks like the iron cooks much faster. Yeah, having this uh, different version seems to be making this go much quicker. All right, yeah, let me just, um, I'm going to work around the house a little bit, get my feet wet, see if we wind up with an attack or something. I thought I was getting some scrap back when I was um, upgrading yeah, so that I could, um, you know, uh, add some more barricades along the wall. I think another thing I'd like to do today is possibly upgrade the workbench and see what happens. We should probably do this. I've got the, the, the material for this. I should do it. Uh, I think I do. Maybe I don't. I, I don't seem to have any metal in my uh, bucket here. <laughs> I've got no scrap at all, it would appear. I think what I did was I used it up on these barricades here, just to have a little something for us to be able to shoot up. If I have to shoot from up here, okay. That's, that's fine. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens when we get ourselves attacked. Uh, but I'm going to need some scrap metal in order to do uh, any of these buildings here at the moment. Okay, I have cooked down all of the metal. Uh, night time has not come. I have taken this opportunity to replenish my uh, meds. And I'm cooking up a few scallops here as well, just to have uh, a little something to snack on. I've been using the, the, the canned food. We've got the canned food. i got some sodas. i got the seafood platter, so we've got some extra help if we need it. 60 rounds of spear, our iron spear that we made in the last episode. And then, like I said, this yeah, this one I want to kind of see if I can get. Um, we'll do a little more upgrading and see. I want to see about that island real quick to see if there's uh, any iron respawned over there. Is that something that happens? I'm pretty sure it probably does. I gotta think it does. Uh, we've got the speedboat, so we can take the speedboat. We'll get there a little bit faster. Boop boop, right there. So we'll take that over, and uh, we'll have some fun with that. My my stamina energy is kind of low, so I figured what I'd do is I'd wait for the sun to go down, sleep the entire night away, wake up in the morning, and off we go. We'll see if we don't wind up with some kind of uh, an attack in the morning. I've got to think it's going to happen sooner than later. There we go. Got our water. Speedboat. Let's do it. Let's take the speedboat. We have not done that. We did a little bit in the last one. A little bit. A little bit. Got to go easy, I guess, right? I don't know how much... It used just about all the gas we had went into this, so... I can hold down shift and get going really quick, but that's going to burn through that gas pretty fast, so I don't think that's something I want to do. I'm seeing how fast this trickles down. There's okay. That, I thought those were trees for a second there, but that's not. We've been there before, of course. Discover District 43. Oh, you know what? Yeah, we got to go back and discover all this stuff again too, because like I said, now that I've switched to the box and I've switched to the test branch of the version to get the packing box, you know, now we got to go around and remark all these things. That's okay. We'll see if there's any activity on this island. I put a flag here, so I don't think there will be. Well, I, the trees certainly didn't come back, did they? Let's see. I wonder if I remove my flag here. If that will allow them to spawn here, and then I can come back and conquer the island like I'm supposed to. You know what? I think I might do that. Discovering highway passes. 
Okay, I'm gonna get, dig up some more of this iron here. Uh, hello, can I get you? Maybe if I crouch? Okay, this one looks like a little baby node down here or something. I don't know. Let's do that. I'm going to go ahead and bust this. I'm going to bust that flag. And we're going to see if maybe they don't spawn here again. Because I've taken that out in a way. Do we have any more iron here? I left these trees here. Just because they're nice. Uh, I think we're good. It was just a couple of nodes that were back. So they didn't all come back yet, but a couple of them did. So I imagine over a period of time they all do eventually, right? Uh, so let's go ahead and get our hammer back. Let's take this down and we'll come back and see if they don't spawn on here maybe. There we go. You know, maybe they'll respawn. And we'll fight them off the island. We're, we're doing pretty good with the uh, weaponry. I'm going to kind of curious to see if this stuff has respawned now. All of it. We got some... Uh... Okay, this looks different. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe the things did not respawn. Let's see. We got these guys right here. Six of them. Okay, that's normal. A little more of the algae here, too. That's cool. All right. I don't think the stuff respawned, though. I don't think the metals and things respawned. Another crab in the water, and he does not look like he's working very well. Let's get our spear out. You seem to be broken, my friend. You need to get fixed. Uh, chest, yes. Let's go ahead and drop, drop, drop. Okay, that's a little bit of iron right there for us. We've got a cook crab. We don't want that in there. There we go. We, we could actually take these guys and throw them away. I think we discovered this, didn't we? Let's go buy this again. Is there anybody on here? Is there supposed to be anybody on here? I do not know, but we are going to find out. Stormborn Outpost, right? This is where we... Why do I feel like there should be somebody on here? Snack. <clears throat> I feel like there should be somebody on here. What am I doing? There's a little bit of loot here. Not a ton. Let me know if this would normally have uh, enemies on it. This can't be just something. Maybe it, maybe it is something we can just come up and uh, it's easy early loot. I don't know. I think by turning everybody off, the raids and stuff, and then trying to turn it back on, it probably screwed a few things up. And do I regret that? I do. Come on now. I guess I got a crouch to hit that. Uh, some rifle parts it look like right there. Let's drop what we can that will stack. Uh, those, what do we got here? Broken football helmet. Uh, broken hunting rifle. I know there's a repair station we'll be able to make eventually. Roasted meat. Wow, hunger 50. Hmm. Roasted Wahoo, 
mushroom bird soup. We got all kinds of interesting food items. We'll drop that in there and we will drop these things we get rid of actually. We don't need that stuff at all. I think that's it. Let's go up top one more time and take a look around. I think I cleared everything else off of here though. Again, let me know. Let me know. If this has been fudged. There's a lot of, well, now there's a bunch of stuff in here. Uh, my inventory is definitely filling up. Yeah, that was a nice chunk of metal there. You know what I need now is I need wood. Oh, inventory's full. Uh, let's go ahead and drop those. <clears throat> let's take that rubber, though. There we go. I like the windmill on here. That's pretty cool. I didn't notice that earlier. I know. It's huge, but I, I did not notice it. Is there a way into here? Oh. I'm going to drop these boots. We also have now um, health meters on our inventory, on our items. You see this here? There's... Uh, levels of damage to stuff now to your armor and your clothing and all that good stuff oh man I don't have any more room I am all full I could eat something uh, no translation found for a description bird meat mushroom soup and uh, mushroom bird soup it doesn't say it does anything for me huh I'm gonna eat it reduces hunger and thirst rate oh okay Reduces hunger and thirst rate. Oh, God, my inventory is so full of good stuff. That's gasoline. Um, okay, let's try to get a little bit of this put away. All right, let's get this some of this goodness put away. And then we can go back out and get the rest of the stuff we dropped. It stays around pretty long. I noticed they worked on a bug, too, in the game where things don't... Um, Things are disappearing. It looks like wood stacks to 20 now instead of 15, which is awesome. I think that's new. I don't recall that being a thing. That was 15 wood stack too. I'm going to drop you in there and you in there and you in there. And I've got uh, rubber, cloth, and some pieces parts. Awesome. A gas can actually stay in there. We'll leave that there. That way we have gas with us anytime we need it. Uh, that broken rifle. Yeah, that's going to come in handy here pretty quick, I think, for us. I think we're going to be able to utilize that because we're going to be uh, work we're working on trying to get some of those, um, you know, other workbenches put together. Let me drop off a few more things here, and then we'll take Mouth back out the door. Now, this is not supposed to be empty. I can see now up on the right-hand side of my screen, it's marked red. There should be enemies on this, so I'm not sure if I broke something when I did that or if it's going to be okay, but uh, this should have marauders on it. I can see now in the upper right-hand corner of my screen, I've got my best, the thing that actually holds my monitor up that's kind of blocking that part of the screen that um, this is supposed to have bandits on it, marauders. Maybe I should check another area and see if they've if it's populated or not, and then if not, I need to figure out how I can get things to um, populate again. Because you guys know that's, that's the way I like to play. I don't want to just walk on here and do this. I was concerned about the attacks at the beginning um, but I feel like we've got kind of an idea as to what's going to be happening, and they are working on the raids again at the moment. That's something that's being done this month, apparently. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and throw... I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to go check... Let's go check another island and see if there is anything uh, to see. If there's anybody on it. I'm very curious now. 
If not, then I think what I'll do is I'll back out and um, not reset, but put the settings back to what they were default and see if that doesn't change things. Okay, that says mutants up here. Yeah, I wish I'd, never, I'd noticed that on my screen. I've never noticed that before. But it shows what faction is actually there. Uh, there was like a mutant island, right? Is this it over here? Is this the mutant island? I think this is it. Trading outpost. Okay, we got that discovered again. Let's grab this. This is the mansion here. Let's see what it says on the map when we go over mansion. Does it say 100% or does it say back to what it was before? Um, no, the mansion is definitely... A, okay. It, it does show that we have been there and we have looted a bunch of stuff on it. I'm curious about this mutant island. I want to know if there's anybody here. If there's nobody here, then I know I've still got something wrong with my settings. Mutant settlement. Yeah. There's nobody on that. So I'm going to have to go back in and put everything back to default. Because, yeah, we've got to have them. We had a base attack, and I've had a couple other base attacks, too. So we know those are working, but this part is not. And I don't like that. I want to be able to go in and have some battles. That's that's the, that's the going to be the fun part, too. So, yeah, let's go, let me go ahead and do that. Let me reset, and then I'll come out here. We'll, we'll take another look around and see if we've got this worked out. Because I've been having... Uh, you know, it's radio. I'll be back. Well, according to the settings, it actually put everything back to the way it was at the very beginning uh, when we reloaded to get the packing box. So why if this is not populated? I don't know why they're not populated. Um, I'm going to zip around a little bit just to let you guys know an update that I did go look at that and it seems to be just fine. We should have populations on those islands and those locations and I'm not quite sure why we don't. Um, so I'm going to go just kind of poke around a little bit more and see if I can find anything at all that looks uh, hopefully normal. I hope I can find some enemies. There is nobody on the mutant raft at all. Drowned downtown. I'm going to go over here and see if there's anybody else that I can... I'm trying to just see if I can find any enemies at all on any of these locations. If they're not here, then I don't know what the issue is. Again, I don't see anybody here. Nobody's shooting at me. Nobody's yelling at me. I don't know what to say, guys. Seems to me somebody should have taken a shot at me or something there, so I don't know what's going on. Okay, let's take a look at some of these things we need to build. Gun shop, ammo workshop, and armor workshop. Let's get these three taken care of. We need iron, we need steel, we need rubber, we need copper, we need all kinds of interesting things. Or should I work on getting this other workbench upgraded first? Because we could do all of this stuff now to get the uh, third upgrade. Maybe we should upgrade the workbench. Let's try that. Let's grab our rubber back. We'll grab those back. I thought I had more of these. I must be going through some of them and I just didn't realize it. I'm going to grab all of that and we need the copper and iron, correct? Let's grab all the copper and the iron. We'll do that right there. And we've got a couple more right there. Perfect. And let's go ahead and I think I needed... Did I grab some cloth? I did. Okay, let's put that coal away. All right, we needed, I think it was three rope to do this. 
Yeah, three rope. Okay, so back to inventory. Here we go. And one, two, and three. And then let's go back into here. Research table, tier three. Let's go ahead and upgrade. There we are. Small generator. Uh-huh. Provides power to various electrical devices. Consumes. Okay, so that's one of our first things we got to do. There it is. Recycler. Drag unused items into it to dismantle and obtain partial raw materials. There's a floor lamp, a ceiling light, table lamp. Oh my gosh, look at all this cool stuff right here. Homemade revolver. Two gun parts. I think we actually have the gun parts, so we might be able to do that. That's plus 50 damage. This is plus 25. Black powder ammo, I see. Black powder ammo. Oh, black powder ammo. Hmm. Iron armor plus 18. We could actually do that right now. Combat knee pads, batteries. Okay, we can make batteries, huh? Okay, that's interesting. Headlight gun parts. Okay, but the first thing, yeah, is probably get this small Jenny going, huh? Get that going. All right, let's see what other workbenches we could make. Now that we've got that upgraded, we can go to... Oh, I don't have enough of that, but I do have enough for the ammo workshop. And then there's the armor. Let's go ahead and build this guy. Ammo workshop. I think this would be a good spot for an ammo workshop right here. I guess what I could do is move this lantern. Ammo workshop. Shotgun ammo, rifle ammo, pistol ammo. Not even something I need at the moment, but there it is. So we could probably move that guy and make him look a little bit better. This box right over here can go with uh, with this right here, I think. I'll start putting ammo in there. Uh, what was the other one we had? Let's go back to build. Okay, we did the ammo workshop, the armor workshop. I need 15 wood, and I get the armor workshop put together. And then there's the gun workshop, and I don't have enough of the pieces parts. I'm really shocked by that. I thought I had more of these. I know we can make them now, but I'm not going to make them. It just seems like a waste of material. Um, what did I need? I needed some wood. All right, back to build, and we are going to do the armor workshop. All right, very nice. Okay. Maybe I put this one kind of here in the middle. Well, we'll just put it right here. You know what? Let's do this right here. That's not disturbing that door, right? No, I don't think so. And the ladder is right there, so that's kind of in the way of the ladder. Well, I need more room. A lot more room, huh? There's some big old workbenches in here. Let's go take... We'll take the armor one maybe downstairs. Boy, it's just... They're huge. You need a lot of building. You need a lot of space for these workbenches. Let's try putting it right here for now. Do that right there. I should probably make some of these curtains or these these blinds for the windows so that nothing can get in and do uh, damage to stuff uh, over here in housing. I should probably put some of um, these metal windows in place to protect some of the stuff because I've got, yeah, let's do that one right there. And I think I'm going to go ahead and put one down here behind this guy right there. That looks nice, huh? That looks actually pretty cool. Let's see. Can I open that? If I open that, what does it do? It opens inward, huh? Okay, so I just have to be on this side. I could do that right there. All right, sweet. Okay, that's a nice workbench. But we got an armor workshop. Okay, we've got a motorcycle helmet, football helmet. We've got a broken one of these. Oh, I see. If I get that rubber and the two iron ingot, I can have a plus 18. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, we actually have that broken football helmet. What's on our helmet now? I think it's it's 15. So that's only going to be three up from that. It's not really that big of a increase, is it? Maybe it is, and I just don't realize it. Nevertheless, we have that right there. Police vest plus 30. This is some good stuff right there. Okay, and then the other workbench we had, and we're not going to be able to do at the moment because we don't have enough pieces parts, is the gun workshop. We need two more of the parts. If I'm not mistaken to make that, it's like... Uh, where is that at? Where are those pieces at? Uh, it's not in here. I don't think it's in there anyways. Uh, it's not in here. 
here it is components yeah it takes an ingot and rubber and glass to make components and I'm not willing to spend any of those things on that stuff I'm just not uh, we used up the rubber we just found all right let's uh, go ahead and take a sleep if we can sleep the night away yep something to eat something to drink yep there we go everybody's a little bit happier now nothing oh man part of me feels like I broke the world you guys let me know what you think I mean I verified all the files and all that good stuff so I, I don't know I don't know I'm a bit confused by it to be honest I'll keep monkeying with it though I really do enjoy the game it's it's been fun feel like this is something we need to get work done yeah we'll get this taken care of upgraded and everything but I need more metal more metal uh, which means I probably should do some serious diving as well um, let's eat and then I need to drink as well all right let me see what I'm gonna do next there seems to be one two things missing from my base and that is my air tanks I can't seem to find them anywhere I was grabbing a few things to go out and do maybe a little deep diving with you guys and I can't seem to find my air tanks what does it take to make those I had two I was gonna make two more so I'd have four oh back in look at this it, it, when you open up the different tiers now this wasn't here before the repair station I don't recall seeing that before at all this is for our armor we definitely want to have this guy put together so we've got the parts for that let's do that I just bumped into that while I was going through the workbench let's research that and then how do we build that guy Research, anvil, gun, ammo, repair station, build. Yeah, we definitely want this guy right here so we can do... Well, let's let's put him down here, actually, right next to our rebreather. Yeah, I have no air tanks. Don't know what happened to him. So if I do this... Oh, okay, you just have to hit F and it repairs your stuff. Okay, sweet. That's all you got to do with that guy right there. Yeah, I don't know where they are. I can't find them anywhere. You guys know I had a couple of them last time we went out. They're not in the boats either, so I don't know really what happened to them other than maybe they disappeared when I was doing those changes to get the uh, box back in my... Um, the packing box available to me. So I'm going to leave that there, and I don't need any wood on me right now. I'll drop that there. I've kind of got the stuff together to go do some deep sea diving I need to just figure out how I need to make these air tanks where are my air tanks at oh we're being attacked Oh, he's coming up. Look at this. Let's get some meds on. coming up on the base this time around I like that oh nope 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 run oh what the heck just happened to me okay I got froze up hold on oh my gosh this is bad
I can't seem to move very well. Oh, what is going on with my screen? I also need my hammer down here on two. Can't hit that guy to save my life. Oh, this is ridiculous. <laughs> they are really good shots compared to me. Let's close that up. We gotta make some repairs to our armor. We need some med. Bandage. I can't hit that guy. Yeah, I can't hit him. I can't hit him to save my life. Shot that dude in the head, finally. Oh, I can't hit him. Can't hit him! Got this guy over here just floating in the air. <laughs> yeah, I can't shoot these guys. They're not getting... They're, they're not taking bullets. Let's try number four. Got him with that one. He's down. Oh, we got oh, we got some dancing guy over here. Did he get up? Did he get up here? about dead just about dead again boy that does not give you much health does it reloading seems to go slower now they've made some changes to that oh, oh these guys just yeah you can't hit them you can't freaking hit these guys there we go oh I can't He's just he's just zigzagging around over here on shore like crazy. Got him with that one. Is he dead? Did I get him? Oh, finally. Good lord, you guys. Yeah, that really needs some work. Really needs some work. They are very difficult to hit. Um, they're just, yeah, they're very difficult to hit. Uh, anybody else needs searching? You're done. I did enjoy the fact that they actually got up on the base this time around and were able to, you know, move about, which tells me that maybe us making that walkway here would be a good thing. Might save the day, you know. Let me get here and get warmed up a little bit. I'm freezing. Have you gone through all of my health items? Imagine if I slept. I would probably do better. I think I got everything. Holy cow. They did a number on the place. Lots of, uh, lots of damage. Didn't take long for them to uh, kind of rip right through some of this stuff, for sure. 
We want to get that reinforced stuff. I still have a little bit of trouble getting the repairs to happen properly, it seems like. Like here, you know, I'm banging away. 565. I don't know what I'm... I think it's what it said it was what I was repairing, but it seems like it takes a long time to... It's hard to tell. Some of these are taking some damage. You can see here. Okay, I can repair the flag. I should probably move that someplace inside, or probably up on the roof would be the best place for it. I did like the fact that the guys were getting up on the base and coming at me. That's nice. Uh, it's nice to be able to have a little, you know, hand-to-hand -hand combat with them instead. They didn't break anything except for, of course, our defenses on the side of the thing here. All this stuff is shot. All those spikes we put up here are gone, pretty much. They're just shot. Well, this is odd. I can't make the small air tank. <laughs> I don't know why. I've already learned it, but it's telling me I have to learn it again. Um... So something something went wrong uh, when we we did this uh, change. Is that number two? Yeah, and I need an iron bar. So I'm losing some resources on that right there. Uh, I need more than well, you know, I'm all, that's research. I I can't even make it yet. That kind of sucks. Now I've got to go out and find. That explains why I couldn't find it in my inventory to craft it. Here it is. And yeah, metal. I need components and I need rubber. So all that stuff, I lost both of my air tanks. Unless I can find them, I, I don't know where they would be. Um, I don't know where they would be. So I'm a little bummed out about that, that I've lost my air tanks. I think I've gone around and checked just about every location to see if I've got them anywhere. And obviously it removed them from... From my my memory completely gone so I'm thinking there's maybe some other things that I don't remember either and I'm gonna have to re-research them let's take a look and see number one uh, the water bottle I had that researched already but the two-handed axe I didn't have research what about here no nothing there that's fine and then nothing in there so I do have to learn the water bottle all over again Which is kind of weird. But I guess it is what it is. Is that what, I, what, is that what I'm supposed to say here? It is what it is. Uh, so I have no air tanks. I have no freaking air tanks to go deep in the water at the moment. I've got none of that stuff. So those guys can go right in there and just sit in there. Because yeah, I've got to do that all over again, I guess, is what I've got to do. It looks like it. It's a bit of a bummer. I'll, say, I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, I need some more bolts and stuff too. Yeah, I've just got nothing. I've got really not much going on around here. <laughs> it's just awful. Um, yeah. I think it's metal, right? For the rounds. Did I, did I manage to keep that information in my head? I did. Okay, that's good. Uh, make those for the next fight that we're about to get into. And then crossbow bolts. I need these guys too. There we go. The crossbow bolts worked really, really well against those guys. It seems to work really well every time against those guys. Uh, but that's, yeah, that's going to be all, I've, that's all I've got time for today. Sorry about that. I've hopefully, hopefully we, we got a few things done today's episode. We had a nice attack, got to see that. I'm not so sure about all this. I, I feel like the rework really needs to be done on the raids. They're, they're causing, uh, it's not that they're, they're causing damage. They cause a lot of damage, which is difficult to, I feel like, get out and get the stuff you need to come back and make the repairs necessary to your base. Repairing it is one thing. What I didn't do during this last fight was check to see if I could repair while there was a fight going on. Can I fix the wall that they're shooting and repair it to full again? That I don't know. We didn't get a chance to do that. It didn't seem to let me do that last time we had a battle, so I'm not quite sure about that. Um, but yeah, I'm 
I'm on the rail here. Let me know what you guys think. Please, please, please fill me in on how you feel about the whole thing. Uh, I'm, I'm curious also why I don't have anybody showing up on my islands. I realized I was the one that turned off the, um, you know, the, the raids and all that stuff, but I've turned all that stuff back on. So it seems to me these islands should be populated. Things should have, you know, folks on them again that we have to go fight. So let me know what you think. I'm the Radio Man 03. Have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.